Hey guys, it's the Ghost Ribbit. I'm in here with an awesome video. I'm making a new segment, amusement park reviews of all the amusement parks I have been to. This is for Six Flags Great America, my home park. Great way to start it off. Let's start with the roller coaster lineup. This roller coaster lineup is fantastic. They have a great wooden coaster lineup, a great B&M collection, they have an aerodynamics coaster at Schwarzkopf. They have a launch coaster. But, so I'll give them an 8. One thing that would be better for Six Flags Great America is if they can add another launch coaster, like one of those Premier Rides Skyrocket 2 models, and uh, a Giga and a Strata, and that's about it. Now for the Throwing Dark Rides. The score is going to be vamped up to a 9 because they have the Justice League Dark Ride for 2016 and they have a Drop Tower, a Huss Frisbee, and a, wait, a Frisbee type ride and a Top Spin. Now for the Family Rides. They have like 35 Family Rides. They're enjoyable. I'm giving them a 7. Now for the Water Rides. This park has a great lineup. They have a Log Flume, a Boat Flume, a a Roaring Rapids type ride, and a Shooting Water ride, which is hard to find at amusement parks. I'm giving them a 10. They got, like, the full package of water rides. Next is the Landscaping. This park does pretty good with this. For a Six Flags park, they're, like, really awesome at it, but for parks in general, it's average. I'm giving it a 6. It's fine. Next is Theming. This park does not have a whole lot of theming. There is some theming present, but not that much. You might find it on Dark Knight or Superman Ultimate Flight or X Flight or Demon and maybe a few other parts of the park, but that's about it. I'm giving it a 4. The food is fine. I'm giving it a 5. The, the prices are pretty high for the food at Great America. And I. Uh, it has the typical amusement park food, not much. And the final category is the operations. I'm giving them an 8 out of 10. The roller coaster operations are awesome. They run two trains on them on most of their coasters. On Raging Bull, they run three trains. And this park has some of the best operations ever. Of all the amusement parks I've been, it's probably one of the best parks with operations, but the family rides have not that good of operations. It takes forever to load and unload the family rides. And the overall score is 71.2 out of 100. This is a great score. A little over the average 70. This park is great for its roller coasters, water rides, and throwing dark rides. The family rides could get a boosted up, same thing with roller coasters and everything else, but this park is a phenomenal park, and one of the best Six Flags parks in the chain. Stay tuned for more videos.